everybody. As you probably know, it's me, the Red Mage Pro, and welcome back to our Grandia Let's Play, where this could be, could, not is, could be our final recording of this series, which makes me a little sad, yes, of course, but if anything, I do relatively like to get through games as fast as I possibly can. And thinking about it, we do have a mana egg, which we don't really need kind of it's kind of weird actually um let's see what does justin need i think that he needs uh axes yeah he need it he's needing and he's very lacking when it comes down to axes and i don't think that they sell any axes here nope not a one but is there anything here that's relatively effective on insects fire Effect upon ghosts. We don't relatively know what we're going to really be uh, doing. What is the hit base? She can only use maces. Okay, well now that we know, we can... There's relatively nothing there that I relatively do want. It all looked good, but uh, present very good. Do we gotta go to lose that? I think we gotta go to lose that, right? <laughs> We, I don't think we've been here yet. Definitely. I feel like I would have remembered some worms. Alright. They're snakes! They're not worms! What do you mean they're freaking snakes? Splendid critical attack on one enemy. And she has all the magic! What the frick? Hello? Meteor strike? Hold the phone. I gotta see this. Oh, explosive power, come here. <laughs> Jesus! Oh, and it wasn't like an AoE, it was a single. It was like a single attack. Okay. Duly noted. So let's go ahead and use Dragon Cut because, you know, we need like all that good jazz. Um, honestly, we should probably be using Thunder Whip just so that we can get some, you know, electricity going. Cut jazz, you know? Mm -hmm. Yep. What a stench! Oh boy! All right. So hey, you know what I noticed? I noticed that I, like many other YouTubers, can look at their analytics. What the frick is this? I opened a door. A door with a cannon on it. Was I supposed to do that? <laughs> Anyways, and I have noticed that 69% nice of the people who watch my videos are not subscribed. So, hey, you know, if you like what I do, and you like the fact that I play all these various different games, then, you know, hey, go ahead, subscribe! We're all for it here. I mean, goodness gravy. You got all these games at my disposal, and I can play pretty much almost any single one of them. And, hey, you know, maybe if you want to see a particular gameplay too, you can tell me down below, and, you know, I might play it. If anything, like, I do, I do technically want to get, uh, Digimon Cyber Sleuths. I want to get those games out of the way. Yes, that is true. But, I don't want to relatively just go on and basically... Do I want to go do Boom Pal? Yes. Uh, I don't want to just go from one RPG right on to the next. I don't think that's relatively, you know, the thing that I typically want to do. I know that we kind of do something relatively similar because of the, uh, magic art. Like one enemy with animated art. See, she has a lot of interesting things that, like, I just confuse. Okay, just gonna say that the, the forest magic seems kind of lame. Not gonna lie. 
Um, but yeah, no. Uh, I want to do something different, and we've been doing a lot of Metroidvanias. We've been doing. Oh, look at that! Oh. Woman, does that mean that the things that I was fighting outside of your thing? Does that mean that they were freaking drawings? Were you drawing things to kill me with? My lady. No use in hiding. Uh. And also, you have me like this, right? Like, I am a freaking... I have the attention span of a gnat, and I typically go from here and there. And I try to stay on target, but I keep losing my target. <laughs> So, you know, with that being said, uh, I don't necessarily want to jump right on into another, uh, freaking RPG as much as I want to. I want to basically change it up. I want to keep going the route that I basically have my entire channel kind of set up, which is, you know, There's to be no playing various play. different games. Uh. No. So, the next one isn't going to be like a survival. It's not going to be an RPG. I don't want it to be... I mean, it could technically be a survival. Just not necessarily like, you know, horror survival. So, you know, we could we could do like another Let's Play of RimWorld. I do like RimWorld, but I don't know. There, there, there are other options I have that I can't necessarily relatively look into right now. I mean, technically, I think I can't... No, both of my phones are dead, so I don't relatively have a way to do it. So, there, there is that. But, uh, you know, there are other games that... Hi. Oh, dear God! No! <laughs> there are other games that I basically have that we could definitely try and play. Of course, you know, you can't fully get, you know, away from, like, the RPG, like... Oh my god, there's more! Uh-oh! We're in trouble! <laughs> oh no! See, this is where... God, I've been playing too much Bravely Default! I just want to freaking default Brave and kill them all! I can't do that in this game! Oh no! Oh my god, and they're really freaking loud too! Uh, do I go with a little bit... Do, we'll just go zap all. And Rap doesn't make the, He doesn't have anything. So he's just gonna have to attack the one that's going to be attacking all of us. Uh, Luyete basically has zap all too. We'll do that. I also have some root beer. You know, if there's one thing that I could really get down with, uh, when it comes down to, uh, you know, being sponsored by, hey, uh, any particular root beer company, please let me know. I love root beer, and I am willing to be of service. That was rather simple. Somehow. Okay, so there's nothing in there. There's a treasure chest in here. Mage lips. Let's let's just go ahead and put that back on Leithe. Leithe, here. Leithe, please. Leithe doesn't want it, guys. Okay, well, if anything, let's go ahead and uh, continue on. So, what do I know that I have? I know that I have been really, really wanting to play, uh, I, I, I think it's called Kakarot. I don't know how well that is, though. Like, it looks really, really good. But, like, I just don't know if I want to play it, you know? Like, let's see if I can turn on, like, my main phone. Cause like I got like a media phone and then like my gaming phone and then I just realized that all my people are kind. It's not all my people. It's just Fina. Now you'll be okay. Fina's just like low health. No. And if anything, like, see, it kind of bugs me that water and earth 
don't have like a primary attacking skill magic thing. And so for like attacking with water, I have to use this, which ups not only my water, but it ups my, oh my God, that's an earthquake. Oh no, Fina! We gotta defend. We'll defend until like Liete is uh, kind of good. And then we'll use her magic to resurrect Fina. By the blessing of God. There we go. Look at that. And that way, Fina, if she does get revived by this, it's called resurrect for a reason, right? Yes, it is. So, you know. Basically, I just want her to get the EXP. You know, that's all that I relatively really, really want. So let's see. What do I... Where is my... Uh, library. There we go. It would probably be better if I just went through... Uh, On my computer, but hey, you know, uh, beggars can't necessarily be choosers. They're just kind of jumping like that, uh, one Legend of Zelda Link to the Past boss. Oh my god, I could do a Legend of Zelda Link to the Past randomizer. I know that game. Pretty much almost like the back of my hand. Huh. This doesn't seem to be like the right place to go either. And then even then, like, I don't have all my games on, um, Steam as well. I have some off of, uh... <laughs> uh, I also have, uh... Flippin, what's it called? Uh, epic that I can relatively go through as well. Oh, lightning, strike down the enemy! Uh, let's see. What here seems interesting? I think all of these are kind of like games that I have like a relatively high amount of time on. Kind of. So I've played all of these technically to a certain degree. Like, I know that, like, I want to continue Wack Fu, but, like, I want to continue it with my sister, so, like, I need to get her, like, at least a decent gaming computer or laptop or something. Uh, that way, uh, she has something and I can play with her on some games. Oh, look. If I go this way, there's stairs. Lovely. So I could, I have Dino Run, but that would be a very short one. I've beaten that game back when it was only on the web. I love it too. It's a very good game. Take this. Um, I also have like an idea to have like a series called Finish That. Uh, probably a very weak name, but it's relatively- Oh no, controller! Oh, controller, no! <laughs> and basically it's just where we finish some, th some things like Resonance of Fate, really probably easy. Sekiro, I'm gonna hate Sekiro, Dying Light, um... You know, all these things that basically I can technically do. Uh, we, we also have, like, we also have to finish, like, Dead Space. I got some games that I'm specifically saving for primarily uh, myself as well. 
God, I hate the noises these things make. See my power. Like, we could always play, like, a little bit of a Sonic Adventure games. That would be very nice. I could put up some Halo Infinite whenever I play it. We should probably finish Bastion. That was one of the very first games we kind of had on the channel. want to finish Sonic Lost World with how uh, uh, the enemies in that game are kind of becoming really, really uh, popular. Like, they made a return in Forces. They made a return in the comics. Which, the comics are, like, really, really nice. I'm just gonna steal this seed. Yay. gonna leave that money there as much as i like money i don't need that money let's see we're just gonna go with the uh cut secret move dragon king i kind of want to finish up valley and sony as well For like, ooh, I do want to finish up Axiom Verge, but we've been playing a lot of uh, Metroidvania s games. Right now, I kind of have a claw grip. There's some money over here on my controller as I kind of. Uh, we're getting to the east portion. I do want to play Dandara. Like, I am really, really kind of like, uh... I'm gonna play that after I finish up, uh... After I finish up Resident Evil 3. That's for sure. I do have the Mega Man collection that I can basically do. When did I get a Hat in Time seal the deal? I gotta finish up the uh, Hat in Time uh, DLC at some point. I love that game. Gadwin, secret move. Dragon King. There's our mellow. Bloodstained Ritual of Night. All of these. I could do Broken Age. Uh, Child of Light is an RPG. Coffee Talks would probably be a pretty nice chill game to do. That was an easy victory. Uh, Dark Souls is more of an RPG. Could do with some more Dead by Daylight. Haven't had a lot of time for that game. I'm pretty sure that the meta has definitely changed. 
Нормально. You see, this is like, this is me trying to, uh, kind of do two things at once here. Let's go ahead and fight this. I think Disco Elysium is an RPG type game. I also have Disgaea. I know that I said that I don't really want to do a Disgaea game on the channel, but honestly, the first one wouldn't be too bad. But just the first one. Nothing more, nothing else. Here goes. Ha! I have the DuckTales remastered. That would be a ver fairly nice one. I see something on here known as Dungeon Siege. I think that's one of the games I've tried to record for the channel, but it just doesn't work. I can try to see if I can look into that, though. I have Graveyard Keeper. That's kind of a... Kind of a Harvesty Moon... Uh, Stardew Valley kind of game, I think. Uh, Garumin... Monstrous Adventure. Let's see. Just gonna try to raise some of my electricity for uh, Justin. Got Knights and Bikes. I think I want to do that with my sister. Legacy of Cain. I have all of them. As much as I don't want to. Little Nightmares. Mag Runner. I do have to do the other uh, Middle Earth game. I don't think I want to do that if I don't relatively uh, do the first one on the channel. <laughs> Pretty easy. Night in the Woods. I do got Psychonauts. Except Terracor is a very old game that I used to have for my uh, really old computer. I have all the Shadowrun games, so we could also do that too. Shadow Warrior. I did get Shovel Knight. And I really want to play Shovel Knight. Ran oh, Rando Hurl. Okay. Oh, wind twist like a tornado. Uh, Star Ocean, The Last Hope. Two different Tales games, The Banner Saga. Oh, he has something known as Ice Slash. Is that all? The Final Station, The First Tree, Messenger. I have Titanfall 2. Apparently there's like a... Way to play that game online now. From, like, what I heard, there was, like, a server I can download or something and uh, play that game online. I've always been interested in the Titanfall games, that's for sure. I do have Rainbow Six Siege. Been kind of missing that game, to be perfectly honest. I'm not good enough to where, like, I feel like I could definitely make a video on it. Let's see, do I... We'll zap. Zap who? This guy? This guy, I guess. Burn to a crisp! Zero Escape. I feel like I need more diversity. A lot of those games, I feel like, uh... They're all too similar to one another. I don't know if that's just kind of like me, or if that's actually true, or something of the sort. I'll take a look into it. So 
So, like, maybe something like Kakarot might actually gravity. Or maybe, like, Kakarot, or whatever it's called, would be a good game because it's different. But I feel like it would also be really, really long, seeing as how Dragon Ball... You know, how Dragon Ball technically is. That was an easy victory. That was an easy victory. Hello, housekeeping. Rich man. Oh, it just dropped us down there. How dare you? Fine, I'll go down here then. No, you don't. Okay, I guess you do. I'm getting ambushed by two Yeti. Earthquake. Let's see. I could burn player, but I think that we're all relatively decent when it comes down to that. Giant we'll just uh, giant blast this cred. We hit both of them. Now, Reg Shock. Jesus. A poor Yeti didn't stand a chance. Oh, there was something in here? Hello? Well, don't I feel sheepish. Imagine if all of them just, like, sand wave. Or if all of them tremored. And then one just decided to... Liete, what did you just do? Look like you gained back some like uh, mana or something. We'll just burn fire. Oh, thunderclap in the darkness, come here. Going to all heal. See my power. And then we're gonna just burn them all. Lovely. Alright, we won. I wonder what we need in order to start learning some new stuff. Or like what we're close to. Let's see. For Justin. His fire is almost 17. His wind's almost 17. So if we continue down the path of lightning, we'll be relatively good and learn some kind of physical type move. Uh, apparently... Oh, that's Dragon Cut. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we got like one electri electricity slash that we can relatively learn. So that's good. And then... Let's see. If we level up some water, we get a new uh, ice move. Gotta really work with fire, too. But fire is just about, like, all of our main attacks. So it's not that bad. I'm not seeing a lot of forest-type moves that Justin can learn. As a matter of fact, there's only the one. Right? No, he learns Cure. But that's about it. Everything else is just kind of, uh... Ugh. His last possible offensive move is... You know, an ice move. And then... 
you know, an earth, a uh, forest, whatever it's called. Overall, we're looking pretty decent. Then it's gonna be the same with me. Whoa, what the frick? Why, why does a uh, water and wind have to be up that high? That's even higher than World End. That's actually kind of scary. Where are we? I swear, if this like puts us all the way back to the beginning, I'm going to be angry. <laughs> Hello? Where are we? I am so confused. Oh, thunderclap in the darkness, come here. So we're going to endure with these two so that Justin can get some of that good old magical EXP. In which he can't hit all of them, probably. And the zap is like a really, really big one. It is. What a cinch. All right. And then we need to start using Crackle as well. don't know where I am and I don't know where I'm going why is this thing freaking out like it is that one little tile where am I we're at J base what <laughs> this was built by the Garlisle Liete do you think Gaia I don't have a voice for her, and I don't think I want to put a voice for her. This is quite different from what I had expected. It seems to be a separate end of ice. Constructed on top of an Angelonian ruin. I sense the powers of Gaia inside. You know, I'm just- I, I was going to say, right? Why aren't we being fired upon? There's a little bit of mutiny going on that I do remember. We've taken the command center and the steam cannon machine room. The control room will be ours soon. If Colonel Mullen in the tactical command center can arrest General Ball, our mutiny will have succeeded. All personnel stand by until there are new orders from Colonel Mullen. All personnel stand by. Mutiny? What is Mullen up to now? What about Gaia? What's going on with Gaia? Come on, you guys. Let's go. Are, are you guys good? Oh, I've heard about you. You're Justin, aren't you? The civilian boy. And you've done your share of mischief, too. But that's all behind us now. Stay out of the way, though. This mutiny will mean a whole new army for us all. Led by Colonel Mullen. Our orders are not to defend against an intrusion, but to keep a certain person from escaping. Very odd, but I believe they are what's right. Our fates ride on this mutiny. We must succeed. How many of our comrades are dead under the rubble and the ruins of that shrine? Is that any way for our soldiers to die? No! Their lives are wasted. Wasted for the sake of Ball's boundless ambition. That is why the Colonel, his own son, has struck him down. To prevent more senseless slaughter. I mean, he hasn't struck him down just yet, but I get what you're going at. Man, I miss Guido! A base officer's quarters. Hmm. Oh, look, they have, like, a nice little bed. Is there anything I can interact in here? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. There has to be, like, something in one of these, right? Right? Just, it's just, like, a question of, uh, 
exactly which room would possibly have it, and if there's a treasure chest. It doesn't seem like there's anything relatively here. Command center? Oh, jeez. Uh... Well, those wings! Do they also represent carrying wings? Can't be sure what General Ball will do, but better stay on guard. Cornered, but not caught. The Colonel has ordered us to wait here. But I wish I could have taken care of the General myself. He talked of world peace. That scoundrel sullied the honor of Garlisle for his own selfish ends. Oh, look, there's a door here. Hackcom Center. Oh, no! Ugh. Ugh, reinforcements. Too late for me. The Colonel. Help the Colonel. The Colonel chased Ball. Ball had a secret passageway in the corner statue. Oh, so this... This is where they, the mutiny was basically happening. Okay. Mullen! Mullen! Mullen, are you okay? What happened to Ball? J Justin, why? Why did you give Ball the Spirit Stone? Huh? By giving him the Spirit Stone, you gave him the key to eternal destruction! Didn't... Didn't you realize that? But... But I... Hurry! Ball must be stopped! For the world! Gaia! He's going to! Mullen! Mullen, are you alright? Don't worry. He's just lost consciousness. Ah! The gen. Ball has gone through this passageway to where Gaia is kept. He means to unite the spirit stones and awaken Gaia. Please, Justin. Mina, you must stop him. I see. It seems that this leads to an underground ruin. And it seems to have been used to build some sort of facility. Ball! I won't let you get away with this! Well, there's a scary. Okay, that's not a door. There's a savey point. I'm going to save. I'm going to be right back. Okay, I'm back. Hmm. There's money here. This can't necessarily be, like, exactly the end, right? Oh, I have to go in this? Okay, okay. Crabs! Oh, no. There are monsters here. Great! I mean, we're getting closer to, uh, Gaia, so I guess... Quote unquote makes sense? Question mark? Let's see, what do I really want? I think that we've relatively learned or exhausted all of the uh, quote unquote electrical stuff that probably Fina can learn. It'd probably just be, uh, wind at that point. Have I ever mentioned how, like, uh, the icon down there kind of looks like Greymon? I probably have. I'll do it again. Oh, thunderclap in the darkness, come here! That was an easy victory. Hmm. Nope, don't want to bite you. I honestly think that at the level I'm at right now, I can actually do this. I don't think that there's any real reason for us to relatively, like, 
grind up anymore, other than to, like, learn the best healing magic or, you know, something of the sort. Which is probably going to be, like, the key thing to do, which is raise up the I the water. But the thing is, is that all the stuff that basically, like, goes with water doesn't really, really, uh, do too much. I did say that I was going to try to, you know, level up the electricity too. Because we're going to learn, like, some kind of physical electrical move. Not sure how that would relatively help us, but, uh, you know. Oh, Crackling attacks all enemies with diamond dust. That's probably the, uh... The move that uh, our good boy Justin is probably going to learn. Wind twist like a tornado. Probably. If I actually were to do like ice water shenaniganry. <laughs> Pretty easy. If anything, they're, they're making you fight these guys, so we might as well oblige. Not very happy about the noises they're making, though. Could really do without the noises. At this point, I wouldn't mind getting Crackling. Because if we get Crackling for Justin, I'm pretty sure that would be the best point. That way we can level up, you know, water. And if we level up water, we'll be in a very good position to basically uh, heal up. Everyone's looking nice and healthy, so this is fine. No, Liette! You've been bitten! That means you're going to turn into, like, some sort of... You know what? They, 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 they're all gonna die. They don't deserve this! But I'm doing it! <laughs> there's, like... There, there, there's, like, also no way for me to skip this, either. Bye bye. <laughs> oh my god, that does too much damage. I wonder how they balance that for the uh, for the very final. Is that gonna be an ambush as well? Yep. I wonder how they balance that for like the very final fight. Cause like you would you would assume right that. I'm just trying to see, like, what would be the best course of action. You would assume that, like, they would have balanced that for... Like, something, right? Because, like, I... I got that pretty early on, I feel. Like, not early on, but, like... Fairly towards the end game, but even then... He's probably just gonna have either multiple forms or I would I would assume multiple forms. That way you can kinda nuke one and then not be prepared for the other. And then like you use all of your magic for like the one and then you're kinda screwed. I mean after all that's kinda what I would do. And if anything, like, it's not like, uh, games are above doing that either. Feel the power of ice. A lot of games typically have, like, you know, multiple stages to a final boss. All right, I think Bayonetta, 
Kingdom Hearts. Final Fantasy definitely has some. You know, so it's I, I wouldn't I wouldn't think that this game wouldn't have it. I honestly think it would. Oh explosive power come here. Just so elegant. Dead. 